Okay, so this is supposed to be um, a quick tutorial on how to create an app that uh, somebody else has already written. Um, here I'm trying to um, show you how to create a Graph3D app that I, um, I wrote. So um, first, uh, because the app is based off of the advanced graphing app that's built in, we'll uh, highlight it. Don't actually um, start it, just highlight it and click on Save. And uh, we want to save this as Graph 3D. Then hit OK. And hit OK one more time. And now it shows up as selected. Let's go ahead and open it up. And it looks exactly like the um, advanced graphing app, as it should, because it's supposed to be just a copy of it. Uh, let's exit it out of there with Escape. Uh, go into the program editor and select it. Um, we want to clear this off, so click Shift, Clear. And I, I've got the source here. It's um, right here. I'm just going to copy all of this. Okay, so presumably you have the source of the program that, you know, or the app that you want to use uh, from somewhere. Let's go back to my graphing calculator. Uh, paste it in, and just for good measure, oops, let's see, looks like we've got a couple, okay, well, didn't seem to like that version of it, I've got a, here it is, let's try that one more time, I grabbed that from a, from a web page, and maybe the, uh, the conversions there didn't, didn't work quite so well. So hit the check button and make sure that everything is okay. It should if the program was properly written. Let's escape out of there. Go to our apps menu and select Graph 3D. And here's the uh, the app itself. So I can enter in a function here. Let's take a look at one divided by 390 times x cubed times y minus x times y. on view so the view allows you to edit function we just did that reset the plot settings this is the sort of the default um, window settings but you can change them yourself yourself if you go to the window settings and just go through the prompts here um, let's go ahead and take a look at what the plot is so um, this is again just a an example app um, you know I've got a little more that I have to do with this but um, this is the graph of our function. Some things I need to add, for example, clearing out the screen and whatnot. Um, but uh, that gives you, a, hopefully, an idea of how it works. 